Let's talk about typography. Now, just like the printed pages all around us, 95% of what we see on screen is text-based language. I point that out because it underscores the importance of typography and how dependent we are on the letters we see in just about everything that we use. I want to start by giving you a quote from Emil Ruder, who's a famous typographer. And he said, today we are inundated with such an immense flood of printed matter that the value of the individual work has depreciated for our harassed contemporaries simply cannot take everything that is printed today. It is the typographer's task to divide up and organize and interpret this mass of printed matter in such a way that the reader will have a good chance of finding what is of interest to him. So look at that quote. What's he saying here? He's saying, look, there is so much stuff out there competing for our attention. There's so much printed matter, typography, letters, words all around us for our harassed contemporaries simply cannot take everything that is printed today. It means information overload, okay? It means there's too much to deal with, to read, to look at, to absorb, to interpret. He's saying it is the job of the typographer or designer in this case, which is you, to divide up, organize, and interpret this mass of stuff so that people can, you know, find what they're interested in. Now, this was true in his time. This was 1969, okay, is the attribution for this quote. And he was talking about printed matter. If we take this same statement and replace printed matter with online matter, read it again. It's still absolutely true. Same deal. Same problem, same solution. Here's another one. Typography has one plain duty before it, and that is to convey information in writing. No argument or consideration can absolve typography from this duty. A printed work which cannot be read becomes a product without purpose. So again, he was talking about printed design. He was talking about writing. If we take those same things and replace them with current terminology, this statement is still absolutely true. There is nothing more important than typography. There is no situation in which typography is not responsible for making sure people understand what they see. This, my friends, is the importance of typography, of letter forms, of words and their relationship to other words and paragraphs and their relationship to other paragraphs. And that is what we are going to explore here.